welcome back. It is that time of the month for Ipsy Unbagging. Yay! If you're unfamiliar with what Ipsy is, it is a subscription service that's $10 a month. You receive five beauty samples, usually deluxe sizes, sometimes brushes, sometimes a full-size product is thrown in there, mostly high-end brands, maybe some indies, and just a little bit of everything. Anyway, it is, again, $10 a month. There's a link down below. It's a referral link so that if you do subscribe, I receive extra Ipsy points which you can use to purchase things from the Ipsy shop. I believe you get extra points for using my link. So without further ado, let's unbag this. As in true fashion, you know I ignore all social media. I don't watch anybody's unbaggings until I unbag mine. So let's dig in, shall we? I usually like to feel around the bag. It feels like everything fit. Um, so we'll pull out the card and it's called Black Magic Ipsy Beauty Spells. So there's the card like that says on the back we've got some tricks and trades up our sleeve three ways to get on the magic at ipsy.com slash glam bag so has all the info on the back on the instructions on what to do hashtags and things like that so let's pull out the bag oh that's that's so cute it says here look at this oh it's got little ouija boards and ghosts and witches and spell books and it's like a really light blush pink color which i love um and it says ipsy heart yalfrey jalfrey valfrey hmm i don't know what that is but um sure we'll find out so uh, it's got look at the little tag it's a little spooky ghost that says Ipsy on it. Oh, that is so cute. He has little heart eyes. I don't know if that's going to show up on camera. I hope it does. See his little eyes? They're hearts. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. So let's dig in and see what's inside. First thing here is from Tweez Cosmetics. It's called Eve's Ready to Wear Lipstick Moisturizing, Moisturizing Hydrant. And it says it's called Love. Perfectly paraben free. Uh, and the name of the shade is Romantic Red. So I've not heard of this brand, but look at this packaging. Is that not dynamite? It's so heavy, too. So heavy. So let's open her up. So it is a, ooh, that is a pretty perfect red shade. I know, I think when I look at my camera, everything looks pink. I don't know. When we go to edit, we'll see. But actually, no, this is just a really warm-toned red, pinky red, I would call it. Not like a brick red, but a pinky red, but... Very flattering on most all skin types. Uh, when you open it up here, it says she stops a moment to eat some berries that make her lips lip color deep red. So, oh, I love this. And again, the packaging on this is just, it's gorgeous. So can't wait to give that a try. Oh, this is from Makeup Forever. This is the Ultra HD Foundation. And oh, let's see what color they sent me. Cause you know, you do fill out a survey and they get your skin color. And I have the shade Y445. So that's going to be yellow toned. Oh, and I have never used this foundation. It's even got a little pump on the sample. Let's see how this uh, blends in with my skin tone. Oh, it might be a little dark for me. Oh, yeah. Um, here, I don't know if you can. It's kind of bright out today. So, yeah, you really can't see that. Um we're getting you know i'm going through that transition phase on you know between summer and winter and my skin tone really does change a lot i don't know it seems kind of orangey for a yellow tone to me but um that's it right there so i don't know how well that's you know going to show up there but yeah you can see that's definitely not my shade right now um i really do like this though because i'll tell you what it blended right in um but summer this is probably definitely my shade but for such a yellow undertone, I don't know why it's really kind of has that orangey cast to it because I'm much more yellow than I am orange. But anyway, I will give that a try. I mean, I think I can probably pull it off this time of year, so definitely give that a try. And that's a general sample. I should be able to get a couple uses out of that at least. Okay, next up is a brush, and it's from Me, Me, Me. It doesn't say what kind of brush it is. I would say this is a, looks like a blush brush. Ooh, hmm, one hair off, but that's okay. Uh, it's, oh, it's super soft. Oh, oh, that's like blush. <laughs> I love a good brush, super soft, but yeah, I think this is a blush brush. 
definitely but i mean you know brushes or whatever you want to use them for you could definitely use it to whisk away under the eyes um definitely blush so super super plush but the, again this is from me 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 so it's three up next this is from indie beauty this is buttercream antioxidant lip scrub Ooh, well, it comes in a little bit early, like this i love a good lip scrub now, i'm not gonna put it on because i already have my lipstick on it doesn't really have a smell and it's it's like super scrubby but unlike some lip scrubs where you kind of dig into the pot this has actually got some hardness to it you know what i mean like like it's got some hardness to it so it's not going to go like everywhere and i believe that sugar for the scrub it might have just a little bit of a vanilla scent to it not overpowering though uh, let's see it has organic sugar shea butter sweet almond oil beeswax avocado oil vitamin e oil buttercream flavoring and sweetener so i'm guessing splendor or equal or sweet and low because it doesn't say what kind of sweetener just sweetener mm, that smells really yeah i can smell buttercream that's what it is the very light vanilla scent of like uh, buttercream frosting is what i'm smelling with that but that seems very nice and um this is an antioxidant one and that's all the ingredients i like that when you can read all the ingredients on there so probably pretty safe to lick right off as well okay last object in the bag Ooh, -hoo. this is from nyx this is a vivid brights liner and this is in gunmetal now this i know is a full size because i have one of the ones they used to have the vivid are these called the vivid brights i can't remember what these are called because this is all worn off but i have like one of those here it's a brown one i love to use so this is a full size of this so we'll have a look see what gunmetal looks like so you gotta kind of work to get the brush a little saturated but that's what it looks like there i don't know if that's going to show up it's gunmetal it's kind of a uh, silvery it's gunmetal that's what I call it, but boy, is that reflective here. Let me walk over here. That is like super metallic reflective. You see how that's catching like right there at the end when I twist my arm up? That is real pretty. So that's always fun to play with stuff like that. So yay, can't wait to give this one a try and play with it. So, and that was it. The inside of the bag is black. This bag is adorable. It's, it's adorable. It's going in my purse today. So that is it. That is everything that was in my Ipsy bag this month. It's a very good bag. I really enjoyed the stuff I got. You know, the Makeup Forever HD foundation, the, um, the Me 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 brush. It's a very nice brush. We'll have to see how it holds up. I really do love this lipstick color. We'll definitely have to give this a try and see how it wears. And this is a full size, so I enjoy getting that. The uh, lip scrub. You know me, I, I love my liquid lipstick, so I'm always scrubbing my lips, that's for sure. And uh, the NYX Vivid uh, Eyeliner, you know, I mean, this is always fun to have something fun and a little bit different to put on. So I love getting stuff, I love colored eyeliner, I love getting stuff like that. And the bag. Can we just take another minute and look at this adorable flipping bag? Look at that kitty cat right there. Oh my gosh, so, 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 so cute. So again, that is what I have for you today. I hope that you did enjoy this video and spending some time with me. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, please uh, hit that little subscribe button down below to keep up with me. And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.